What's up guys? Welcome or welcome back to the channel one more time. I know my eyes are kind of like bulgy right now. But guys, I'm on my way for my TV test. You know what I drink from today's title and thumbnail. So I am actually having a my TV test in Lagos. I am. So I'll just take you guys along to hear guys a little of my experience. I know that maybe it has changed, you know, when 2024 or something or if it's still the normal one like i've watched a lot of videos i've seen like a whole lot of things so yeah it's becoming real and real guys like i cannot wait i seriously can't wait right now like my own eyes are so like swollen right now but anyways guys yeah i had to wake up like very early and yeah just you guys will know the just whatever with that being said if you're new hi my name is Chidi welcome welcome back to the channel and if you're an old subscriber welcome back to the channel anyways if you've not subscribed yet what are you waiting for please subscribe and with that being said let's just get right on to today's video so right now i am all dressed up ready to go i'm just waiting for my mom is that my mom that i'm going to be going so yeah i'll see you guys bye Hey, it's been a while I've spoken to you guys I just got into the bathroom and you know I'm not supposed to actually film right here so I just got my certificate and I'll tell you guys like my experience when I get home, like we're going to finish this vlog when I get home, guys. So the bus is right here to pick us up. So where we are going so so yeah. I just got my certificates and I came to the bathroom. So I just said let me do a little video and I'll see you guys at some bye. <laughs> Hi guys, so I just got back from um, IOM and sincerely, guys, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, like I was already about sleeping when I realized, I already pulled my wig, pulled my clothes, when I realized I'm not doing about the video yet, like I've not told you guys um, how my experience is all together, so I decided to wake up, pop up my wig back and then when my shirt just to tell you guys so yeah i've collected my certificates guys and if you're wondering how it looks like if you're wondering this is how it's been given to you so i would not open it for like security reasons you know i would not open it for security reasons like i don't know if it's a ban something to share but this is just what it looks like this is what an envelope this is how they would give you your certificate so my certificate is inside this right now and yeah so basically this is it when we first got there um you have to go with your um receipts your receipts payment i don't know if he's here let me check if he's still here i can just show you guys oh they collected it guys they collected it this is the only thing this is my appointments this is what i went with this my appointment this is my appointment that I printed out, the booked appointment I did. It's something you can do by yourself. If you want me to show you how you, um, to do it, you can tell me. I will do a video personally on how to book your IOM appointment because it's not the same way um, we used the last year. It's still the same way, but it's just that when you use the gov.uk um, um, website, it will redirect you to the IOM website. So basically, that's just the... The, the simple change but it's still the same thing so this is the appointment i went with and then i went with my um with my passport 
arrived with my passport and then the oh, receipts like this is the receipt of payment how you paid like i transferred to the um iam account and that's the receipts i used i'll pop up like the soft copy maybe here or at the side for you guys to see what i'm talking about so i printed it out and this is how i went this this appointment this passport and then with the i am with the payment slip um that i did so when i got there they will just check your payment slip your passport and then you need to go with a nose mask as well if you are not your nose mask they won't let you in and my mom actually followed me but this is the perk they always didn't allow my mom to come in with me because they're like ah, i'm i'm a grown up i'm i'm 1999 why did they need my mom why does my mom need to follow me and all that so if you can do this on your own no problem but i could actually go on my own but i just like wanted like i was very very tired like stressed out i don't know if you guys can still see my eye like my eyes are swollen right now i still need a lot of sleep so basically yeah they checked um this and then asked um let me in you need to have your nose mask so when they let me in i walked through the door and then when i got inside the thing is we couldn't video we couldn't vlog i could not vlog there is no way i could video like the whole process because you are not allowed to use your camera inside the premises so once i got inside the premises i even from outside the premises Seth, they would already start telling you cannot like you from past videos that i watched and with the way the whole environment and the activity was today there is no way you could actually like do your video and all that so when we got inside the premises i passed through the door then they let me in to sit and then they asked me what country i said uk and then they took me to a place to sit so when i got there i was given this there was something that i was given i'm coming hold on guys Wait. guys i'm coming just hold on i'll get it okay guys so i'm back i was given this i was given this um thing which they now told me that i should check i should um go on my website and feel this whole thing like i should go on my i should go on my google dial this website i don't know if you guys can see it this website right here and fill everything in capital letters oh now that i'm even thinking at it it's written here so anyways that was the first thing i did then after that a lady came to collect her passport checked it i don't know what she checked but she just collected her passport checked and then came back to meet us and she just gave it back to us so after that we were taken into a bus now this is where it got kind of tricky for me because all of the videos that I watched past never talked said anything about them entering bus to go to another IAM center because I did mine so if you're wondering or I don't know if I've said it in this video I'm doing my I did my TB test at Ikeja IAM the IAM center at Ikeja so yeah we entered the bus and then it was so surprising for me we did just a little registration that's after this registration and she checked her passport so we entered into a bus so i don't know if so don't don't be alarmed if maybe you get there and then you are to enter a bus so we entered into a bus after that i we got to another im center i would actually maybe look for the address and then put the address here of that center because it was just it, it's not really far from the isaac john own streets but it's just out 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 maybe i will so we went to that center one when once we got there they collected our receipts the one you printed out they'll collect it then go in to verify your payments once they verify your payment they'll bring you back to you then they will take you to the data registration center which is still in that same premises so they took us to the data registration center and then they start asking you a question so that form that you fill online make sure you are very very careful and you check it very well because they will actually even explain to you when you get there because the thing is once you are giving your certificates you cannot if you want to change anything again you have to pay a sum of thirteen thousand six hundred so you need to be very very careful very careful like i know what i'm saying so the once you get into the data base they'll give you a token this was the token that was given to me so they'll give you a token this number and that's it they'll give you this number and then they call you so 
we were not much the crowd today was we were not much i don't know maybe it's because of the time i decided to do my tb or because of like the whole exchange rates and then all oh, dependent thing i don't know so yeah after i was given the stocking i sat down with um a guy who just took me through the whole data registration process the whole consent form so a consent form will be sent to an email a day before um your your appointment so make sure you check your email because i checked my yesterday and that's how i saw it i didn't even know so just check in so you have to sign on the consent form just read it so that when you get there you just and you don't need to read it again that's why they give it to you again so that's how you do it and then you just confirm the thing on your database and after that you they you just printed out this receipt so this was the original receipt they now give me for my payment i don't know if you can see it so that was the receipt so he gave me this receipt with my token like this and my passport because you also you would you would ask for your passport a lot so make sure do not forget your passport so with my passport this is i then i went he directed me to a room after i went to the room immediately i sat down not up to two minutes after um a lady con a lady came here i think she's a lady radiographer the one that would take the church she called us and was like two females so we went inside we were asked to pull our shirt our shirt bra and i had to remove my wig i got the white gown then i got a checks and she done after that i was asked to go out I was asked to go out then i met the doctor after that the doctor just asked a few questions then i was asked to come outside to wait for my certificate so i waited i didn't even wait up to one hour i did not wait up to one hour and i'm not going to, like sincerely guys i did not wait up to one hour and i already got my certificate and i'm super excited so that's all that happened to me and i hope this is okay and this is detailed enough so if you have any questions please leave them in the comment section below and with that being said up until next time which is my this application bye